get out of my way. Yeah, buddy. No, those don't open. Okay. Wait, I got somebody shooting me. Nice. It's a good kill. Alright, now I gotta work my way back up. This is a promenade. century and you're still running around with only a tiny knife for protection <laughs> it's stupid all right Desmond game's over not now not now is <laughs> just Christ, that dude's like a maniac. Enough is enough, Mr. Miles. I invited you here in the spirit of cooperation, but you responded to my hospitality with only violence. I had hoped we might preserve you and further study your memories. But you're not worth Come here. Oh, snap. It's 
Where's Vinny? Fifth floor. I did. I did. I killed him very much. Stopping me. What's up, bitches? I think your security department's getting uh, restructured Please today. Kill me. I'll let you in. you hadn't noticed, I'm the one calling the shots. Now give me the apple. You want it? Fine. Here it is. Wait! No! Nice. Everything on the line for what? So you could rescue your father? Yeah. I'll take the computer. Could always use another computer. powerful. The end is nigh. I'd get the power source hooked up before heading back into the Animus. But it's your call. You know, I've never hooked up these power sources. I, I, I wonder if that's a, just an automatic thing or what. Hey Desmond, didn't Subject 16's... His name was Clay. Sorry, didn't Clay say Washington was a Templar? No. He indicated that Washington came into contact with an apple of Eden, but beyond that, it's all speculation. Furthermore, judging from the portrait referenced by Clay, the 
event occurred much later in Washington's life. Perhaps Connor wasn't even involved. It's very hard to know for sure. We just have to wait and see what, if anything, happens. Interesting. Okay. So, let's go talk to good old daddy -o. Hello. Hey. Do you think... Uh... Hello. Hey. Do you think killing Vidic set Abstergo back? I doubt it. I'm sure he pioneered the Animus. But they've had the technology for decades now. Plenty of other people can take his place. And Cross? Oh, he was a loose cannon. I doubt anyone's mourning his death. I think these days he was more a symbol than an asset. Hmm. I'm sorry, I don't mean to dismiss what you did. But it's going to take a lot more than a couple of deaths to stop the Templars. Alright. I regret not asking you to hack into the Abstergo servers while you were there. A couple of well-placed relays and we'd be swimming in information. We have everything we need. Yeah, except the key. We're close. How do you know? I just do. Okay, so I don't know much about hooking in the power source or anything. I, I assume it's an automatic process, but I don't know. I just don't know. So what was it like being back at Abstergo? Oh. I didn't expect to get out of there alive. It's a good thing Cross broke down the way he did. If he wasn't losing his mind, I'd probably be dead. I guess he never really recovered. What do you mean? When he first came to us, he was exhibiting symptoms of the bleeding effect. It was real bad. He'd just go in and out at a moment's notice. No animus required. Got a little violent, too, sometimes. It took a while and a bunch of therapy, but we thought we had it under control. Once he went back over to Abstergo, though, who knows what they did to him. I still worry about that happening to me. He was raised in an animus, Desmond. There's overexposure, and then there's... Daniel. Poor guy. That could never happen to you. We won't let it. Okay. Time to jump back into the animus. Sequence 11. Here we go. Home stretch, Desmond. I can feel it. The tides of war are turning. The loyalists fall back beneath the advancing Patriot army. Their hold on this land weakening by the day. But the Templars only seem to grow stronger. Though fewer in number, the threat they pose appears undiminished. Making matters worse, Washington chose to spare the life of Charles Lee. I am told he has taken refuge inside Fort George, and so my days are spent searching for a way to breach its walls. Of my father, there is no trace, and I am glad of it. If I can be rid of Lee, there may still be a chance for reconciliation, and through it, peace. The homestead. Sequence 11, Davenport Homestead, 1781. Connor? He's asking for you.